welcome to the mathematics of my channel today we are going to solve another interesting question related to integration question is we need to simplify 2 to the 20 20 integral from 0 to 1 x to the 1009 times 1 minus x to the 1009 dx over integral from 0 to 1 x to the 1009 times 1 minus x to the 20 20 1009 dx okay first i am going to take this integral is equal to i1 and this integral is equal to i2 okay now i2 is equal to integral from 0 to 1 x to the 1009 times 1 minus x to the 2020 1009 power dx okay now i am going to use subsidiary method so if we take x to the 10 10 is equal to t when we differentiate we can take x to the 1009 uh, so I'm going to use a substitutive method uh, x to the 10 10 is equal to t so differentiate 10 10 times x to the 1009 dx is equal to dt so limits when we plug in 0 here x approaches to 0 so t approaches to also 0 when upper limit when x approaches to 1 also t approaches to 1 so we can write here 0 to 1 now x to the 1009 times dx is equal to dt over 10 10 and here 1 minus now x to the 20 20 we know x to the 10 10 is equal to t so the here t square power 1009 times now x to the 1009 times dx is equal to 1 over 10 10 times dt then Mm, we know this property of definite integration so 0 to e f of x dx is equal to 0 to e f of e minus x dx okay now i am going to use this property so we can write here uh, 1 over 10 10 is the constant so we can write outside of the integral so 1 over 10 10 integral from 0 to 1 1 minus now according to this property here 1 minus t square to the 1009 dt okay now here 1 over 10 10 0 to 1 now if we simplify this 1 minus 1 square so 1 get cancelled and next term 2 times t minus 2 times t times minus so 2 times t and last term t square times minus so minus t square here 1009 power dt okay now here t is a common factor so we can write 1 over 10 10 0 to 1 now if we take t as a factor so t to the 1009 times 2 minus t to the 1009 dt well now here we have 2 minus t but uh, if we convert this like 1 minus t to the 1009 we can take a relationship between i1 and i2 so now i am going to use again substitutive method 
so if we take d is equal to 2 times u so differentiate dt is equal to 2 times du and lower limit when t approaches to 0 u approaches to also 0 when t approaches to 1 uh, u approaches to 1 half okay now we can write here yeah, this is equal to 1 over 10 10 here yeah, now uh, lower limit 0 and upper limit 1 half uh, and t to the 1009 so t is equal to 2 times u so here 2 times u to the 1009 uh, times here 2 minus now t is equal to 2 times u so 2 times u to the 1009 and dt dt is equal to 2 times du okay now here 1 over 10 10 times now 2 to the 1009 is a factor and a constant also here 2 is a common factor and 2 to the 1009 is a constant and here also 2 is a constant so 2 to the 1009 times 2 to the 1009 2018 times 2 so we can write here 2018 times 2 integral form 0 to 1 half now u to the 1009 times 1 minus u to the 1009 du sorry now we know here 1 over 10 10 times here 2 to the 2019 integral form 0 to 1 half and now we know definite integral independent of the variable so we can write here x to the 1009 times 1 minus x to the 1009 dx so now we know this is our integral i1 so uh, sorry here 0 to 1 half but our entry limits 0 to 1 so now here we have 0 to 1 half so we can write here if we write 0 to 1 we can write this is equal to i1 over 2 okay now we can write here we of i2 so i2 is equal to uh, now 1 over 10 10 to the 2019 times i1 over 2 well now we can simplify this so 1 over 10 10 and these two get cancelled so to the 2018 times i1 and now we can write i1 over i2 i1 over i2 is equal to 10, 10 over 2 to the 2018 but our question uh, we need to simplify 2 to the 2020 times i1 over i2 so we can write here 2 to the 2020 times 10 10 over 2 to the 2018 okay now here sorry here 2 to the 2018 to 2 to the 2020 so 2 to the 2018 get cancelled so we can write this is equal to 2 square times 10 10 so we know 2 to the 2 power so 4 times 10 10 so the answer is 
okay if you like this video please subscribe this channel thank you for watching